Hi, this is Katie Sevenance. I'm going to show you um, how to use Senegen's cream products. These are uh, some of the eyeshadows. It's called Shadow Sense. It comes in many different colors. Um, we've got a whole array of colors from real neutral colors to greens and blues and, and purples. Um, some have a shimmer to them, some are matte. Um, so there's quite a few things to choose from. Today I've already got my foundation on, a little blush on, pearlizer that gives you a little bit of a, a glow to your skin, a dewy look. I've done my eyebrows in our um, Brow Sense product. Now I'm going to do my shadow. These are a cream product. They are waterproof, smear proof. They will not crease on your eyes, which is really nice as you get to be old like me and you have droopy eyebrows. It's nice to have a product that isn't going to smear all over and at the end of the day have raccoon eyes. So um, as you can see, my my eyelids kind of hang down a little bit which makes it not very fun when you want to have really cute eyeballs. Anyway, I'm going to use uh, Pink Frost and show you I just like to take the brush and go ahead and apply it right onto my eye. And I'm really focusing this light color right down at the bottom and then I'll take my um, uh, brush and just kind of blend that in a little bit. Okay, so now I've got a little of the pink frost. I am going to take some whisper pink and do right under my brow and that will lighten that arch just a little bit. Kind of looks makes it look like my eye is a little more wide open. And it's these are really easy to blend. You can use your fingertip, you can use a brush, whatever works for you. I'm also going to put a little of the lighter color right in the corner of my eye and bring it right in a little bit because you know sometimes we get a little darker right in close to the nose there so this just kind of opens your eye up a little bit and the whisper pink is almost a white just kind of lightens your eye and then I am going to take mocha java and let's see here use the one that's not shimmery and I'm going to use this to sort of make it look like I have a um, I go in here instead of sticking out. So darker colors um, make col make things look recessed and brighter colors bring it out. So I've got a lighter color right on the under my brow, a lighter color on my lid. I'm going to use a darker color that will sort of fade back this skin, my eyelid. So I'm just going to take it and put a little bit right there where my brow bone is and take an angled brush and just blend that in just a little bit. Mostly bring it from the outside and bring it in. You don't have to put too much. I don't like to wear a whole lot of color, but see how it kind of